They were like kids on the same playground, but they weren't playing together. Brock Damjanovic takes us to the Morgan Theater to see how a new program could bring together students throughout the Kane College of the Arts. The orchestra is warming up for something new, an age of interdepartment harmony, and the catalyst for the Kane College change, puppet theater. Students in our colleges tend to get a little bit siloed, you know, the music students hang out with the music students, theater with theater, art with art. And so we thought, what could we do that would really cross all of those boundaries? Of course, the obvious thing was puppet opera. In olden times, the reason they used puppet theater was to reduce the number of cast members needed and also reduce the cost. However, the King College of the Arts' goal is to bring different departments in the college together, like theater and choir. The opera told the tale of Rogero, who leaves the world of women to re-enter the warlike world of men. He goes on to defeat the wicked Alcina, his ex-lover, and freeze the enchanted plans. The idea is to really introduce music students, but now also theater and art students, to historical performance. So what does it mean to perform an opera from the 17th century? How is that different from, say, doing a Broadway musical? This was the idea behind the Performance Practice Institute, a program designed to cross disciplines. This event was a huge step for the program, so in order to ensure the performance was successful, some students went the extra mile. Over spring break, the, us puppeteers went to Seattle to learn how to puppet. Um, we worked with Dimitri Carter at the Northwest Puppet Center, um, and since we've been back here, we've been rehearsing every night with the, with the band and with the singers. And they say it was all worth it to work together. It has been wonderful to work on a project that is, you know, all the different departments of Kane College of the Arts coming together to produce one, one piece of art. It's, it's been such fun, and I hope that we do more collaborations in the future. Brock Damjanovich, ATV News. Though this is the last scheduled interdepartment event, the departments hope this is the start of a more united college.